What happens if you delete a backup? What important information do I need to know before and after the backup removal? Today's video is the ultimate guide to answering queries about the topic you want to know about. Part 1. Is it okay to delete an iCloud backup? Firstly, here's a question should I delete my iCloud backup? Well, it depends. If you have several iCloud backup records and the storage is approaching the critical point, you can delete some earlier backups. Part 2. How to delete an iCloud backup. Managing backups on iCloud with only 5 gigabytes of free storage is a hassle. When you need to optimize the memory space of iCloud or encounter the iCloud backup fail, it is necessary to delete unnecessary backups. Part 4. What happens if or when you delete an iCloud backup? The iCloud backup won't protect your iOS content anymore. The backup copy will be wiped out immediately with little chance of recovery. The iCloud backup option will be disabled automatically in your iPhone or iPad settings. Part 5. iCloud backup takes up much storage? Try the best iCloud alternative. Mobikin Assistant for iOS, a great replacement for iCloud, could be at the top of your list when backing up any iOS devices. How to use Assistant for iOS to back up iOS data to a computer. Step 1. Run the utility on your computer. Link your iDevice to this computer. Step 2. Once identified, select your desired data types. Step 3. At last, click on Export from the top screen to copy the selected iOS items to the computer. Note, alternatively, you can batch backup your iOS device by going to the programs. Super Toolkit, iTunes Backup and Restore, Backup, select your device. Choose a location to save the backup, OK? 